Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back once again. It is me, Malt. So happy to be here with you guys as always. And today you can see that we are on our Clash Without Walls account. Um, it's actually going pretty well. I've, I've been doing a lot off screen because obviously if I, if I waited to do updates and stuff on this, um, or if I did videos every time that I updated something, it would be like every 30 minutes. <clears throat> so uh, we'll kind of do a rundown of everything that we have right now. So I have three of my barracks up there. Uh, this one's level one. These two are both level three, so I have goblins in them. Um, got an air defense right here. Got two cannons, the mortar, and then I also have two archer towers right now. And We are now town hall four. Um, as you can see, we still have no walls. Uh, but I'm trying to come up with exactly what I want to do um, with this account. So besides just having no walls, I'm thinking it'd be fun to do other stuff. Like I haven't researched any of my troops yet because I think it'd be cool to see how high I could go with level one troops. So let me know what you guys think about that. If you think it'd be uh, cool to do clashing without walls, level one troops, uh, whatever, and just see how high we can go with that. Um, and then obviously we're going to be doing... Uh, a bunch of defense replays and stuff as to how things are going with no walls. Um, so I'm actually going to show you guys, oh gosh, a couple. Woo, I'm tired. Let's go ahead and watch this one. So I still lay out my base uh, like I would if I had walls. Um, you can see this guy's attacking from the top right here. Uh, he has some goblins. I'm sure he's just going after the loot because there's a lot of elixir right there. <clears throat> um, but he's laying down a whole bunch of barbarians, but since my mortar's right there in the middle, uh, it's just doing it's doing a lot of work to him. So uh, that's obviously why I have the mortar right there uh, kind of centralized, just like I would if it was any other base. Um, <clears throat> so he only got 29%. He did get an okay amount of loot from me when it comes to elixir. This guy up top uh, got 50%, but there haven't... <laughs> been too many uh, real big losses. This guy got 100%, but that was a long time ago before I really updated anything, I think. Um, I have figured out the clan castle, so I might make uh, a clan for, uh, I don't know, or maybe I'll just visit people. I don't know why I'm so tired right now. I'll probably just visit people um, with it, but as you can see, my army camp over here is level three. This one is about to be level three. Uh, let's just finish it. Oh, I just wasted two gems. <laughs> uh, so all these other, so now my barracks are going to finish filling these up uh, with five more troops. And then we'll we'll get an attack in here. But um, I'm excited to see how everything goes. So I can still upgrade both of my archer towers one more time. Um, I can upgrade both the cannons. I think the mortar might be, yeah, so the mortar is max for this level. Uh, air defense, I'm not really worried about. Um, now that I'm not going to be spending gold on walls, it's going to be a lot easier to upgrade stuff. I really need to clear out all this freaking rubbish so that I can, uh, so that I can get 500, uh, gems to, uh, get a third builder. Um, unless you guys don't care, I'll just go ahead and buy five builders, but I'm sure that y'all wouldn't want me to do that. So, um, <clears throat> we'll just wait and I'll probably only ever have like three builders on this until I do a bunch of these achievements. Um, so I actually guess I need to go, um, I haven't messed with achievements in so long. When 10 stars on the campaign map, yeah, I need to go do that. Uh, <laughs> I definitely need to do that. And then, uh, just continue working my way up until I get another builder. But why don't we go ahead and fill up our army camps again so that they can train up while we're, uh, attacking. And, uh, we'll go ahead and attack and let's see what what we can find and then we have both of our uh, both of our builders up so we can upgrade two things in this video as well. I know a lot of you guys aren't going to find this too interesting but um, <clears throat> I am very excited to see how high I can push with level 1 troops. Um, so I'm going to keep upgrading everything but I'm not going to research the troops, uh, at least not yet. Uh, eventually I will. So I don't know, maybe we can, let, let me know in the comments realistically where you guys think I can go with level 1 troops. Uh, I might can get to Crystal, maybe, uh, if I town hall, if I like pick off town halls, um, which would take forever and be super annoying because it'd be like three trophies per. Um, but let me know what you guys think about that and we'll see how high we can get and that could be really, really fun. Some of you guys were saying that I'm copying other people, but um, I just got an iPad and I wanted to do something interesting. So um, we're doing Clash Without Walls. That's where it's at. 
Um, let's go ahead and shoot. This base has got a lot of loot in it. Um, I want to be out of range of that mortar. So let's take out this archer tower right here and then let's see if we can get our... No. I want our barbarians to go inside the walls. Here. So let's finish taking out this archer tower and let's drop off all these goblins right here because they're out of range of that mortar. Um, and then once we get them in there, then we can go and get all of that gold. Get it all. Oh, or all just die. <laughs> that mortar is too high level. Come on, run around. Go get it. Split up. There we go. Confuse him. Golly. That mortar's doing work. Yeah. Level 1 troops. <laughs> it would be very, very hard to get super high with level 1 troops. As you can see, that, that mortar is taking them out in one shot when it came to those goblins. Uh, so, yeah, that's going uh, to be pretty challenging. Um, I mean, we can do it if you guys want. If not, I'll just keep doing Clash with No Walls. Um, and just see how high we can get with no walls um, and really just play around and watch the funny defenses I think it's gonna be cool to design bases with no walls uh, and stuff like that that's gonna be awesome so we got 20,000 gold which isn't bad um, I think that's like an archer tower upgrade yeah so that's an archer tower upgrade uh, so why don't we actually just go ahead and upgrade both of our archer towers so they're both level three four hours one and two so we're gonna upgrade both of those and uh, the reason that my base is laid out like it is right now is because obviously I want the mortar to cover the whole base it's protected pretty well uh, and then the cannons protect the mortar air defense is just up there nobody's gonna have any air troops uh, right now I don't imagine and then my archer towers are just hanging out down here uh, helping cover the base as well so this is gonna be interesting guys I'm super excited about it uh, comment down below what y'all want me to do. I'm not going to research any troops yet um, Just because I might want to do that level one troop thing, but if it gets too hard then whew, Goodness, I need some sleep if it gets too hard then I guess we'll just um, I don't know just keep playing clash with no walls and see how high we can get uh, It'll be it'll be interesting. It's gonna be it's gonna be funny. I can't wait to see uh Hopefully some of you guys will end up finding my base and attacking it and we can watch replays and stuff like that. So that'll be pretty cool. But that's going to be it for this episode, guys. I hope that y'all enjoyed. Uh, again, leave a like if you're excited about this comment. Let's try and get to, I don't know, 2,000 likes or something. Um, and then uh, comment down below what you want to see from this. So we're doing Clashing Without Walls, so we're never going to build walls. Um, but we can do other things within this, like uh, level 1 troop level one troops to crystal or whatever uh so comment down below guys be realistic though um and yeah that's gonna be it thanks so much for watching you guys rock i really do mean that and as always make sure you keep calm and clash on for me right i'll see you guys later